again we're at Murphy's Point Provincial Park and there's I'm gonna turn the lens around there we go one two three there we go flip there's the beautiful wife in her uh, fancy mosquito headgear <laughs> and we have our tent that we got from Walmart well it's not a tent that's the dining tent I guess and we started up a fire here look at that there's beautiful wife again so yeah our uh, handy dandy tent that we bought from walmart um not the most expensive and it's definitely not seam sealed it leaked like a son of a gun in the rain uh, last uh, last season so we put a f tarp over top just to protect it see and our handy dandy Jeep there we go and I think the newest acquisition the dining tent it saved our life already because mosquitoes have been pretty bad all right so again Murphy's Point Provincial Park and it's uh, June the 11th today Friday and we're here till Sunday and tomorrow is going to be the intact inflatable inflatable boat kayaking which should be fun all right guys so we'll be back and show you the fun in a minute or two <laughs> or three <laughs> we'll see you soon good morning I'm not scared you anymore. Say good morning. Good morning. It's day two. And we're having breakfast over the fire. I'm going to... There's our fire. The roaring fire. And we're making tea now. We've just finished beans and eggs. and I'm going to have to make myself... Eat my own words. I didn't think the dollar store was going to be very beneficial. But this stuff here, it's like a wax uh, coated um, fiber. And uh, it started that fire in no time flat. And I think these things were like a buck fifty. I'm going to call it the dollar something store. And uh, we bought this just on a whim it's a, a, a shovel and I got it kind of like a pickaxe and uh, moving stuff around inside the fire and, and, and that it's it's been working really 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 well and it folds down to a small little pouch um, I gotta stop just pushing stuff on the ground I'm gonna trip and fall um, and what else did we get from the dollar store that kind of saved our bacon um, just all sorts of stuff, but this this whole trip has been based on Are we gonna like camping or not and do we want to spend a lot of money and I think there's a lot of bushcrafters out there that would say that I Mean that tent is a piece of junk It will flood like a like a pool. I put a tarp like I said bef last night over top of it We did have a moderate rain last night and we stayed dry my Canadian Tire tarp saved our bacon. Um, so yeah, we're having fun. Um, we bought, they're gone up to $499 now, but we bought it on sale at Cabela's and I'll show you the Intect uh, uh, inflatable uh, kayak <clears throat> in the next phase of weekend with JR. Um, at, at, a, uh, at our camping adventure. So, um, <clears throat> still waking up. But, uh, no, we're having lots of fun. And uh, it's a sunny day today. We had one critter try to get into our uh, dining tent over my shoulder there. But we didn't have any food there, so no, no harm, no foul. So from Murphy's Point, we're having a great time. All right, well, 
get to back to you when we get into the boats. Me? <laughs> Mr. Turtle, I'm taking a picture of you. Don't run away. Yay. Bye, turtles. I like your rig. <laughs> I'm going to probably recommend that we, as a family unit, don't camp until July, until these things are gone. Also, centipedes. There's tons of centipedes here. Take a picture of centipedes and show. So... We're um, not disappointed with the trip, but definitely we're, we're, we're surprised by the number of caterpillars that are here. It, and I don't know what it is, but the trees are shedding these little brown pellet-like uh, balls. And they're squishy. When you squish them, they squish. And it's everywhere. It sounds like it's raining. That's how many are falling from the trees. But anyway, this is uh, the night, the second day, the eve of the second day, and we're going to be getting ready to pack up and come home tomorrow. So if I have enough footage, I haven't been taking much, um, we'll put something together and, and, uh, and show you guys what we did. Take care, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Well... It's June 13th, and it's pack-up day. It's uh, not early morning, but it's early. Um, we slept well last night, except for we have a whole bunch of little friends. The gypsy moth, and, uh, well, it's the gypsy caterpillar, which will turn into a gypsy moth. And they're horrible at least in in the park here and if you don't like gypsy moths or caterpillars then i would stay away until about july because they were bombarding us all weekend long to the point where we had to go and just go to bed early but this is what it is right there that thing there's some focus now and and they're relentless they're, they were just dropping out of the trees like like paratroopers on d-day um, and the other thing and I never experienced it before maybe someone can tell me 
but all of this brown stuff it's just falling from the trees and it, it, it's squishy it's squishy 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 so it's not hard but it, it just squishes like a into like a powder and I don't know if that's seed or if it's what but we had um, bit of rain on Friday night and again the Ozark tent from Walmart which you can't expect a lot from it's not waterproof uh, the seams aren't sealed and the material itself just uh, it, it repels the water but over time it just starts to to seep through so as I mentioned when we first set up I put this tarp over top and I wish that I had put another one out here in the sitting area um, we bought this uh, Ozark dining tent and it was just more of a magnet for the uh, gypsy moth caterpillar to come in. They're all over the table. They're everywhere. Um, to the point where when I pack up, I'm going to have to really be careful not to bring them home. And centipedes. We had oodles and oodles of centipedes. I don't know what... If it's like a a high cycle for them this year but I've never seen so many centipedes in my life and they're all over the road dead and I don't know much about centipedes I don't know if they bite but anyway um, I'd rate our weekend a good six or seven it would have been a nine or so if it weren't for those stupid uh, gypsy moth caterpillars. But that's a, a quick tour of the messy site. We hung our garbage up on a line there and the raccoons tried but they couldn't get it. Our nice little Jeep, oop. And the site here is so big. Uh, Charbot Lake when we were there was nice but it was so tiny we're so close to our neighbors now we could put a tent there a tent there we're allowed six people to the site and uh, we could even park two cars would have been so easy so <clears throat> That's kind of a synopsis of where we are right now. Soon it'll be tear down. It's about 8 o'clock in the morning right now. But beautiful. See the, see the scenery? Just beautiful. There we go. Just beautiful. Our tent again. So that's kind of it. Um, it's a nice weekend. Kind of a sad weekend too because my dad um, passed away in October on the 8th. But this weekend marks the weekend where he originally started losing his health um, obstructive bowel syndrome um, on the uh, 12th of uh, June just before his birthday and uh, his life changed dramatically for the worse ever since that anyway I'm not gonna get sad and they wouldn't want me to be sad, Mom and Dad. But if my sister's watching this, I say hi. And uh, 
I was kind of thinking of them too at this point in time over in the US of A. All right, well, anyway, we'll uh, probably show you some teardown in an hour or so, which will be a few seconds for you. <laughs> and uh, we'll, we'll kind of sign off for now.